Good morning, everybody. I hope you're well and okay. I need a healthy breakfast. Why? My skin's broke out a little bit. I think it is the vindaloo, the spiciness of it. So if that is the case, then maybe that is the trigger for my rosacea. Um, because it was a really spice. It was quite spicy. I enjoyed it. I really, really did. But it's not done my skin any favours, I don't think. So, a nice healthy breakfast it is. I'm not going live today, everybody. Because um, I have been on for the last few days. So, I just thought I'd make a video this morning. Um, and I've also got a busy day ahead. I've got to go into town. I've, I've got different things on um so so this is what you see is what you get as i like to say <laughs> so i was thinking first things first for a drink this morning instead of my usual coffee i'm going to have fruit juice i thought with it being a hot drink it might make my face flush even more so so my newly washed glass yeah i might i'll try and do a few of these videos today all right so let's get in the fridge i've just had some water this fruit juice oh, that should be enough for the fruit juice oh no, oh no. <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have cracked that off it's made the top all dinty on it oh dear oh no <laughs> The top will not go on proper, so I'll have to be careful and I'll have to put it at the side. It's been in there for ages. Should be alright in, in, in Oh no, can it not fit? Oh dear. Ah, it fits now, doesn't it? So, so I was thinking fruit juice and then, well, there's. After yesterday with the vindaloo, look how much milk I've got left. I've not even got got enough for a cup of coffee. Once Richard's had that with his breakfast, there's not there's not going to be a single drop of milk left. So for breakfast, I have to improvise. In a past video, I have said that you can change the milk to water to have a cereal. So that's what I'm gonna to have to do. I'll have to have water with my cereal. Don't we always sacrifice things for the man? It is true, it's, and it's true. It's no different with me. Yeah, it's off that water, by the way. Water does go off, you know. <laughs> so, at least there was only a little bit in the Anyway, so let me have a little taste of my juice. Yum. <laughs> right, so. What to have? There's fruit and fibre, there's shreddies, and there's Weetabix. So. The porridge. <laughs> Yeah, there is. There's porridge, which is good. So I'm going to have to go into town and get some, some porridge. So. So let's make this in a pan. <coughs> we 
it does have to be with the water um so it'll be two two little sachets of water to go in which is fine and i can even sweeten it with some um blue there is in can even do that so so it's not it's not that big a deal sort of thing not really it'll be fine so i'll just put some water in it so one I would have had milk with it, but <laughs> I have to think of him upstairs. So I'll get to the spoon. I'm listening to um, an old favourite of mine, Jilly Cooper's Paul Law. Um, <laughs> I mean, they have a guilty pleasure, these kinds of books from when it was in my teens, you know, and uh, <laughs> I thought I'd listen to them all, all, all again. Jilly Cooper's Paul Law. At the moment, it's free on Audible. If uh, anybody's interested in that, in that kind of thing. Uh <laughs> It just brings back the memories of Rupert Campbell Black, and <laughs> who's notoriously um, handsome, arrogant. <laughs> so, I believe Jilly Cooper uh, brought out Rivals as a series. So I don't. I no longer have Disney Plus. Um, for some reason it, it went weird with my Disney Plus and I thought no I'll not tackle it. Um whether I'd be able to reinstall Disney Plus, I don't know. I could always have a go, couldn't I? But Rivals is on there. And it stars uh Hayden Turner. Well oh oh Aiden Turner who was Paul Dark. Um, from my understanding though, he doesn't play Rupert Campbell Black. Uh, somebody else plays him, so it'd be interesting to uh, to watch it, to be honest, because I've seen the others, uh, the old ones. I, I saw um, Polo, what I'm reading, and I've also seen the man who made husbands jealous. <laughs> like I said, the uh, uh, guilty pleasure of mine. A bit of a, they are a bit steamy. These books, by the way, if you haven't already read them. <laughs> I mean, that's what's so good about these books. You get to know the characters and what they're like. Um, the books are set, the, they are set in the Cotswolds, the books. So, in a way, I look quite jazzy in this top, don't I? <laughs> Today. I think I have worn this top for you before. So, I'm just stirring this porridge. I don't think I've got any... Uh, honey, or, or do I? To sweeten the pot, as they say, but I have got some blueberries if I don't have any honey. I do know that. Never mind. Never mind, everybody. Oh, I've just realised I've got some peanut butter. <laughs> got some peanut butter, everyone. Must have forgot that was in there. So yeah, it still smells good. Peanut 
know, butter's quite expensive these days. Must have forgot that was in there. Got a lot of cup of soups and other things. Um, so I'm just thinking about lunch and what I'm going to have for lunch. Vegetables is definitely on the list today for me. Vegetables, even maybe some nice fish. I've, I've still got some bassa fish I could use. Richard will not have it, I don't think. Um, but I've, oh, I wasn't going to use that for something else. Um, because I could do with something gentle, quite gentle on my skin today and that's why I was thinking of the vegetables well plan or no plan I think that's what I'm going to have some um, some maybe some fish and some vegetables because I can't think what else I've got in to be honest and I can't be bothered looking Oh, you eat what you get, what you've got in anyway, don't you? So, so I'm I'm just giving it a stir every so often. Uh, this porridge because I do like it sort of thickish, not too watery, that sort of thing. That's my style of porridge. Some people like it thick. Some people like like it really, really tough. Some people like it. Really, really runny. So I'm sort of like maybe just under a happy medium where I do like my porridge quite stodgy, but still a bit wet. <laughs> mm -hmm. So I've got I've got mushrooms, and I've still got a bowl of salad. So it's looking good on some sort of meal today. So Richard, with it being Friday, he might have a pizza. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love pizza, but the state of my face at the moment, it's not, it's not good it's just not good it's it's around here i have just put some treatment on so hopefully the treatment's working it's magic but i don't want to have anything really really bad in case it it sort of overrides the treatment <laughs> so my nails are finally growing by the way um, I am getting a nail on there and a nail on there. Uh, the, the others might take a little bit more time, but my nails are growing. So, things are going in the right direction. But I hope to do... Um, just a, maybe a couple more videos today for you uh, to keep in touch with you all. <laughs> so if anybody wants to watch the Vindaloo challenge, well, it's, it is a video I did yesterday. So, and I did that live, everybody. I did do it live. So, such fun. <laughs> right, okay, so I think this is this okay now or is it still maybe maybe I've not had porridge with no water for a long time. So 
It's only because I've got no milking at the moment until I have a walk into town or whatever. Um, I'm walking a lot more because I do want to lose this belly. I'm not showing you my belly, but, <laughs> well, I just did. I just did, didn't I, sneakily? Um, but I don't like the look of myself at the moment. So I'm going to do it. Keep exercising when I can, where I can. Um, and hopefully the pounds start to fall. And that includes watching what I eat. So. Right, it's starting to bubble a little bit now. Which is, it did take its time. I'll take my chances. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Mm. There we go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're looking healthy there everybody I promised a person I'd never do the porridge in the microwave again and I've stuck to it so hats off to me isn't it Only a few blueberries left, but I'm sure Richard will cut without them. Cut without some, anyway, <laughs> until I do get some more. I don't, you only need a handful, anyway. It's just a handful for make it a little bit sweeter. After all, I'm giving him the milk, aren't I? So. A little stuff. And that's it. There we go. I'll not take his bananas, his beloved bananas. Um, but I'm quite happy with that. So, bon appetit. Mm. So it's it's good to see you all and I hope you're all well and doing well. Um, so hopefully I'll see you later. Okay, and thank you, as always, for watching. See you later. Bye.